can I go first since I wrote this ordinance and then I'll be quiet and let y'all talk and then if I could have a moment in case there's any questions. Oh, that way things are kind of peaceful. This is real simple. Um, the, the title says it all. It's an ordinance requiring that any pending business coming before city council be published in its entirety seven business days prior to the scheduled meeting. So in this case, since, and I appreciate City Hall for putting the ordinances out, um, it was after the deadline. I was a little disappointed about that. But what we've had in the past is, as you've heard the speaker speak to, is um, if you want to speak at City Hall, and how this came about was over the crypto mine issue, because I started getting a lot of phone calls, a lot of emails, a lot of text messages, wanting to know why they couldn't speak at City Hall and what they had to do, and I explained to them there's a cutoff time, and they're like, I didn't know about all that, didn't even know it was on the agenda. And so when I got to looking at that, um, I realized that what's happened inadvertently probably is that we, um, we have a cutoff time of Friday. This would have been last Friday at 12 o'clock is the cutoff time for anybody to sign up to speak. But the agenda that has the items on there that someone would want to speak to doesn't come out until after that cutoff time. Sometimes I don't get the packet till 2 or 3 o'clock. I'm a city council member. I don't even know what's on there until 2 or 3 o'clock. So how can I expect my constituents to know what's on there? And then if they see something on there and they, you know, they want to speak to it, well, they couldn't sign up to speak to it if they want to. And something else that this ordinance provides is it's more than just putting the title on there saying Title 2023-2. It would publish the entire ordinance, such as I have done with this on social media, which Mr. Quinn and, and Mr. Hunter have spoke to. So I, what this does is it requires you to put it out on the website and on social, me on social media, on Facebook, um, but nothing would prohibit any would prohibit the mayor from putting it on other forms. I'm the kind of guy put it out there everywhere so everybody can can know about it. So that's kind of what it is. It's kind of it's kind of a no-brainer. It's pretty simple. It protects the people and it limits the government, which I'm all for. Yeah. <laughs> 